Hi, my name's Jamara and I'm a proud Gunish Jamara Gunai and Mukjarawant woman. Um, I currently live on Wurundjeri country in Melbourne and I'm studying my Masters of Teaching at La Trobe. So I did my first degree in um, public health or health promotion and I also did a degree in international development. So I've been working in Aboriginal health and health promotion for the last few years, which I love. But I guess what drew me to teaching um, was my own experiences growing up and at school. I guess the lack of representation in the classroom and in the school and in the teachers um, is pretty huge and I could see that the ongoing impacts of that on some of the young people that I was working with. Um, I'm really passionate about, you know, shifting the idea that Aboriginal people and culture and history is in the past and can only be learnt about in humanity or through textbooks and rather, you know, that Aboriginal ways of learning and knowledge can be embedded across the whole school system and there's actually so much valuable information and knowledge to gain for everybody. So that was probably my driving point to start studying teaching, yeah. I liked the idea of Nexus because it wasn't just about studying teaching. It was the social justice component. You know, we get to have a lot of conversations about a lot of different topics that I feel are usually left out of, you know, the education space when you're learning to be a teacher. Um, and it's about learning to be inclusive and flexible and the most functionable teacher you can. So you can be flexible in a range of diverse experiences and you, you get to learn all that because you do hands-on experience while you study. Um, I learn by doing, so I love that element of it. And you get to, you know, you get to put what you're learning into practice and seeing it being done in the classroom, which was really helpful. And then on top of that, you also get to build really strong relationships, you know, with the school and the students, which, you know, you don't get to do that outside of Nexus. So in my role as an education support worker, I have been doing quite a few things. I've been in the classroom supporting students and I've also doing, been doing an Aboriginal wellbeing support role, so supporting the Koori kids at the school um, and, you know, also working with the teachers to create a safe, a culturally safe space and, you know, like I spoke about, embed Aboriginal perspectives into, you know, what they're doing and how they do it. So, I, yeah, it's been really good so far. I think it, I think it has been quite what I thought it would be. Um, and if it hasn't been like that, I've kind of just put my hand up and said, hey, I'd really love to do this. And then it's gone in the direction that I wanted. So I think you just need to, you know, be confident in yourself and, you know, be confident in what you want to do and what you know. And generally, I think the school will be supportive of that. Yeah, it's been an interesting year. Lots of online learning, online school. Very interesting time to start a new job, let alone out of school. Um, but I think being in Nexus has been really helpful. That The support has been really, really great. Um, compared to the, like, general masters of teaching, I feel like I haven't been worried about what I have to do or how to do it because there is that ongoing support provided and you can ask questions and have, you know, weekly check-ins, which is really, really helpful. I would say mixed responses. Some were like, what? Why would you want to do that? And some were like, oh, that's awesome. That's, I think most people were like, you will be really great at that. I'm definitely a hands-on doing person and I love working with young people. So yeah, I'm excited and I feel like now that I've started, it's like what I should be doing. Working, yeah, working at the school while I'm studying has been good. Like I said, you get to see what you're studying in practice and I think that just helps implement it into your brain. Like, you know, if you just study it and then don't go into a school for a year or so, you can easily forget a lot of the theories and things. Um, and, you know, it's also helped, you know, with that passion. You're like, this is what I'm... I want to be doing and it helps you like get through your assignments and your studying because you have that real life it's happening as you do it you can't you don't lose sight of like what you're doing it for I think if you're thinking about studying teaching I think Nexus is a really great way to do it um, if anything you just get more opportunities and more support you get to have conversations and learn about 
a whole range of social justice topics, which is, you know, why it stands out to me because education is not one dimensional. Um, and I believe it can be, and it really should be the centre for, you know, promoting holistic wellbeing, especially in young people. And I think Nexus provides a platform for that.